Okay, December 31, 2005, this hamster is severely dehydrated because of this ingrown uh, front upper tooth which had grown into the hard palate so the hamster can't eat and drink and I went to see the vet on the 28th, today is 31st the symptoms appear on 26th, we went to see the vet on 28th I think the vet didn't uh, examine the mouth so so uh, so the vet didn't examine the mouth so didn't notice this uh, this overgrown upper tooth and uh, and what happened is uh, the vet prescribed antibiotics uh, electrolytes and everything but uh, the hamster still cannot eat and drink then the owner had a force feed now the owner force feed but it's no use because the teeth has grown into the hard palate you can see the hole there and now it's bleeding uh. so so now I've cut it already so now you can see the front teeth is much better and uh, the two front teeth are quite short now and the lower front teeth are okay are short enough then you can see the hamster is very dehydrated you see all, all uh, don't have enough uh, fluid so I'll give an injection a very little exosaline subcutaneous with a bit of uh, betrayal a bit and then uh, a bit of like that's a very small drop a little bit then uh, this hamster should recover much faster now uh, okay so subcutaneous injection of uh, dextrosiline plus B3 plus dexa I give a bit of anesthetic gas to, to to cut the tooth because it might be painful so you can see the hamster is very very weak now see the eyes there's an eye discharge and uh, this is the owner trying to force feed the, the medicine from the vet and so you can see all this uh, uh, information from the owner force feeding unsuccessfully because of this uh, overgrown, uh, ingrown, overgrown or ingrown upper tooth into the heart palate. Okay.